So what is going on guys? It's Triple G here with a Midnight Suns video and in today's video we're going to be looking at the new gameplay footage that has been released and we're going to react to it. I'm going to talk a little bit about the kind of strategic game that this is as well as the history of some of these games. Guys if you enjoy this video please consider subscribing to the channel or join us over on Twitch we stream five times a week and otherwise let's get straight into this video. So as you can see from the footage, this is a turn-based strategy game that features the Marvel Avengers as well as some other Marvel characters. Now, if you've ever played XCOM before, you will be used to the turn-based system that 2K have also published before. However, this game takes it to a different level. There is a lot of cinematic cutscenes that are woven into the battlefield, giving you that sense of magnitude, given that you're going to be using people like Captain America, Iron Man, and Wolverine. Now, it's worth noting that once I have finished speaking, I will play the full gameplay trailer and footage all from itself. So if you want to skip to that, please feel free to do so. However, I'm going to give you the thoughts on what I saw and what I liked best. So one of the really interesting things that they've revealed is that there's going to be a central hub called the Abbey. Now, if you've played the previous XCOM games, you will know that you're on like a mothership and you will go around and you will upgrade your characters, upgrade your squad, unlock new abilities and things like that. Now, the Abbey is going to kind of work in that way. However, you're going to use the relationships between the other characters which will then unlock new abilities and new things for your squad. This is something that I think is really unique. So whilst you're not on the battlefield, you're going to be able to just dive into the lore of the Marvel Universe, as well as then being a benefit to your team, unlocking new cards and new abilities for your characters. Now, the game centralizes around a villain called Lilith. Now, the only person known to have stopped Lilith is her daughter, and the, which is called the Hunter. Now, we will be playing as the Hunter, which is a fully customizable character created specifically for this game. So it's going to be really interesting to see what type of abilities that they have as they've had a blank canvas to go with. You're also going to have access to some of the trusted and known characters like Wolverine, like Iron Man, like Captain America. We saw Doctor Strange as well. So it's going to be really interesting to see what kind of characters and what kind of abilities you have. They have talked about the synergies between these characters. You're going to be able to play these characters off each other to do special movesets. And some of the ones that we've seen in there look really, really nice. The one big difference I've noticed from like as an XCOM player to this game is there's a lot more cinema photography between each move set so before it would be a top down and you would just watch your character run up and then do a shot or you know whatever it was on XCOM however it does look like there is much more jazz around these move sets and the addition of working with the environment as well to push people off ledges to push them into walls to blow up barrels and stuff looks really really nice as well Overall, I am really, really impressed with what I've seen so far. Obviously, we're going to need to play it to understand just how good it is. However, just looking at the footage, looking how good the characters look. If you are a fan of the comic books and you are a fan of Marvel, I've no doubt that you're going to just enjoy just playing around, playing as Captain America, playing as Iron Man, particularly the way that you're going to be able to go, you know, and interact with those characters when in the Abbey as well really really is a nice touch as well as all the gameplay stuff that they revealed today they also revealed that there is a ton of abilities and cosmetics for all the characters so that's enough for me guys if you've enjoyed this video please consider subscribing to the channel don't forget the full trailer will now play after i speak and otherwise i'll catch you on the flip Gaming's greatest strategy and tactics experts have teamed up with the world's greatest storytellers to create a new AAA experience unlike anything before it. Welcome to Marvel's Midnight Suns. This new tactical RPG from Firaxis is set in the darker side of the Marvel Universe, packed with a deeply customizable tactical battle system that rewards clever thinking with superhero flair. 
an epic, supernatural story that brings you face to face against the demonic forces of the underworld. A deep role-playing experience where you get to live among Marvel legends and the first customizable original hero from the Marvel Universe. As darkness falls, rise up with the Midnight Suns and face off against an ancient prophecy foretelling the end of the world. After centuries of sleep, Lilith, mother of demons, has been revived by Hydra through a twist of dark magic and science. Lilith will stop at nothing to fulfill the prophecy of the Midnight Sun and bring back her evil master, Cthon. Alongside her is her army of Lilith, demonic forces who carry out her twisted will with fanatical devotion. Pushed to the brink by her return, the Avengers desperately revive a dark power of their own, the Hunter, a legendary hero, forsaken child of Lilith, and the only one known to have beaten Lilith before. In Marvel's Midnight Suns, the player takes on the role of this new hero, who until recently lay peacefully in a centuries-long sleep, tucked away in a quiet crypt on the grounds of the Abbey, the secret headquarters of an organization known only as the Midnight Suns. For the first time in any Marvel game, the Hunter is a customizable original superhero, allowing you to live out your very own Marvel adventure. But you won't be alone. Marvel's Midnight Suns features a legendary collection of heroes that span across the Marvel Universe, including the Avengers, X-Men, Runaways, and more. You'll see these heroes in a new light as you develop relationships and strengthen your personal bonds outside the field of battle. Every hero has a completely unique set of abilities, ranging from damage-dealing attacks to life-saving skills to epic, game-changing finishers. There are tons of unique costumes to unlock, skills to upgrade, and heroic team-ups that unleash devastating combo moves. With your superhero squad picked, it's time to start fighting back the forces of Lilith. Combat in Marvel's Midnight Suns is a cinematic tactical affair that rewards clever thinking with superhero flair. The player controls a squad of three heroes and is dealt a random selection of hero abilities, like a hand of cards. These abilities offer a vast array of tactical choices that expand exponentially when combined with the battlefield itself. Shove, leap, and smash your way to victory using the environment to wreak havoc on your enemies. Send the bad guys face first into a wall, into each other, or just right over the edge. Victory requires a balance of smart tactical thinking and being able to read and react off the battlefield, as well as cultivating your friendships outside of combat and finding the right combinations of heroes and abilities. Battles rage across iconic Marvel locations like Avengers Tower to Doctor Strange's Sanctum Sanctorum, from New York City rooftops to underground Hydra installations from sun-bleached deserts to a hellscape dimension far beyond our own. When the fighting is done, the heroes return to the Abbey, a living hub that the player navigates in real time, experiencing for the first time in any Marvel game what it's like to not just fight alongside beloved Marvel heroes, but to live alongside them as well. The Abbey offers hours of rewarding exploration, gameplay, and story for the player to enjoy. There's even a few lovable, if unique, pets. Get to know your favorite Marvel heroes through careful conversation and shared time together through daily activities. Take a stroll with Tony Stark on the Abbey grounds, or practice meditative yoga with magic. The choice is yours, but choose wisely, because every hero has their own preferences. Developing deep friendships can unlock powerful rewards in combat and in the Abbey. Use the spoils of battle to earn new abilities for your heroes down in the forge. Upgrade current hero abilities out in the yard under Blade's watchful eye. Find new hero ops and missions in the war room with Captain Marvel and much, much more. 
When ready, it's time to choose a new mission. Choose your squad of heroes and return to battle. The enemy may grow more powerful with every fight, but the hunter and the heroes will rise in power to meet them because that's what true heroes do. Nice job out there, kid. I mean, I didn't get Hydra bombed until my tenth run with the Avengers. Kid? You do know that I'm a good three centuries older than you, right? <laughs>